So to perform this asana, lie down on your stomach, hold both your ankles and start to pull your ankles and lift your body up. If you look up, it will help you go even higher. So the aim is to be on our stomach, our whole chest, everything till the point of ribs should be up in the air. Today I'm going to demonstrate the Pashtimottanasana. Besides having all the benefits of forward bends, the Pashtimottanasana is very very beneficial to keep away diabetes. Even people who have diabetes while practicing the Pashtimottanasana can actually cure themselves of diabetes. I will now demonstrate how to do the Pashtimottanasana. Bring both your legs out in front of you, pointing the toes inwards. See to that your back is a straight and the spine is extended with the chest opening giving your body and your lungs enough space to breathe. The ribcage should have enough space for your lungs to be able to expand. As you inhale you raise both the arms up extending the spine further bringing the hands in line with the ears. As you exhale you bring the chin out and come down as low as you can. If you can, you hold your toes and bring the elbows down on either side of your feet, bringing your forehead to rest on your legs. If you can, you can even take the arms around your feet and come down. As you raise up, you bring the hands in line with the ears. Inhale, extend the spine upwards. Exhale, bring both the hands down. It is said of Pashtimottanasana that if you practice it long enough and hold the pose for long enough, it will keep death away. That is the power of this, of this asana. So please do include it in your daily practice.